Good day everyone and welcome to my class. For today's topic, you will learn how to find the area of composite figures. First, let us define what is a composite figure. Composite figure is a two-dimensional figure made up of more than one basic two-dimensional shapes such as triangles, squares, rectangles, circles, and semicircles. Here are some examples of composite figure. Figure 1 is made up of a square and a triangle. Figure 2 is made up of a rectangle and a semicircle. Figure 3 is made up of a square and a circle, wherein a circle is inscribed in a square or there is an overlapping of figures. Now, in order to find the area of composite figures, it is necessary that you can identify basic shapes that made up of a given figure. For better understanding, let us try to find the area of this figure. To get the area of this figure, we need to separate or divide this into two different shapes. We have square and a rectangle and we need to add the area of these two. To find the area of a square, we use side times side or side squared plus for the area of the rectangle, we use length times the width. Now let us substitute or give the value of the variables. For the area of the square, we have 4 cm times 4 cm. Plus, for the area of the rectangle, we have 15 cm times 4 cm. Now, let us compute or find the area of the square. We have 4 cm times 4 cm is equal to 16 cm squared. Plus, the area of the rectangle, which is 15 cm times 4 cm, is equal to 60 cm squared. To get the area of this figure, let us add the area of the square and the area of the rectangle. 16 cm squared plus 60 cm squared is equal to 76 cm squared. Therefore, the area of this figure is 76 cm squared. Let us have another example for deeper understanding. Let us try to find the area of this figure. Again, to find the area of this figure, we need to separate or divide this into two different shapes. We have a triangle and a square. To find the area of a triangle, we use base times height divided by 2. For the area of a square, we use side squared. Now let us try to substitute or give the value of each variable. The base is 6 cm and the height of the triangle is 6 cm. Therefore, we have 6 cm times 6 cm divided by 2. For the area of the square, we have 6 cm times 6 cm. Let us compute for the area of the triangle. We have 6 cm times 6 cm is equal to 36 cm squared. Divided by 2, we have 18 cm squared. Plus, for the area of the square, we have 6 cm times 6 cm is equal to 36 cm squared. To get the area of the figure, we need to add the area of the triangle and the area of the square. 18 cm squared plus 36 cm squared is equal to 54 cm squared. Therefore, the area of this figure is 54 cm squared. For our last example, let us try to find the area of this figure. Again, we need to separate or divide this into two different shapes. 
we have a semicircle and a rectangle. To find the area of a semicircle, we can use the formula for the area of a circle, which is pi r squared. But since we're looking for the area of a semicircle, we need to divide this by 2, since a semicircle is 1 half of a circle. Plus, the area for the rectangle is length times width. Now let us substitute. Pi has a value of 3.14. Since the diameter is 6 cm and one half of the diameter is the radius, therefore our radius is 3. We will have 3.14 times 3 cm times 3 cm divided by 2. Plus, for the area of the rectangle, we have 6 cm times 8 cm. Let us find the area of the semicircle. We have 3.14 times 3 cm times 3 cm is equal to 28.26 cm squared. Divided by 2 will give you now 14.13 cm squared. Plus the area of the rectangle which is 6 cm times 8 centimeters is equal to 48 centimeters squared. To get the area of the figure, we need to add the area of the semicircle and the area of the rectangle. 14.13 centimeters squared plus 48 centimeters squared will give you an area of 63.13 centimeters squared. I hope everything is clear to you. Now, I want you to answer this in one minute. Are you ready? Timer starts now. Write your answer on the comment section. That's all for today. Goodbye until next time.